You may have seen some stories, or you may just have noticed that the price of your Christmas tree is up a little bit this year. Uh, the reason being given is because there's a tree shortage out there. The experts say you could be paying, you know, 10 bucks more than last year on average or thereabouts. Now that comes with this story out there. A family-run Christmas tree farm was forced to shut down during what is obviously their busiest season. A bunch of thieves came in and they just ransacked the farm. It's in El Dorado, California, and apparently, from what we're told, they stole everything, TVs to chainsaws. And the worst part is the crooks are still at large. So I'm joined now from the Cedar Ravine Tree Farm by its co-owner, Eric Shainow, um Skypes in with us tonight. And um, you know, tell us, Eric, if you can, you know, I went through a little bit of it, but tell us exactly what happened here. Well, good evening. So my father went on a short trip for with grandma for her birthday, returned on Sunday before Thanksgiving. They noticed that the front gate on the driveway was broken down. They pulled up to the, the house and the truck was missing. It was parked out front, the farm truck, and all the doors to the house were open. And they went inside and the entire place had been completely ransacked. They went through everything and stole all the valuables out of the house and the barn. Man, so you uh, have said the key to all this, and I think we have a picture, is that if somebody could just find the red truck that was stolen, it's an old truck, I think it's well, the 85 Chevy, is that right? Yeah, the 85 red Chevy S10 pickup. So there aren't many of those on the road anymore. Hmm. So we're confident that if we can find the red truck, we will find the bad guys. Right. I mean, to your, I mean, yeah, it's not a joke, but yeah, really, there can't be, right? There can't be a ton of those. It would, be, it would, kind of, it would stick out, kind of sore thumb. An 85 Chevy, wouldn't Very it? Very obvious. Red in color, 1985. So someone should be able to find it. Man, this and, is... And, uh, yeah, they stole a lot of other key valuables for the farm. Uh, the pot that we built, uh, make the cider for the customers. The hatchet that we split the wood for the bonfire for the customers. And the chainsaws that we use to clear the mountain so it's safe uh, for people to walk up and cut their tree. Man, it's not a disaster. Anything anybody uh, could do out there to help you out? Are you asking the public to get involved or anything online or... Really, really, all we're asking from the public and especially your viewers, and there's a lot of them in El Dorado County, yep. is to find the red truck. Uh, we know it's out there, and if someone could spot it, call the El Dorado Sheriff uh, or California Highway Patrol, and let's get these guys behind bars. Let's hope, right? It's kind of like a crowdsourcing thing, and uh, you know, maybe that works. Somebody spotted it, or so there it is. Somebody saw that truck. Let's uh, let's find it. Not that many out there. Well. All the best. And, uh, boy, we could have had John to talk about this Christmas tree shortage, and that would have been an easier topic for you. Well, we, would have, we would have liked to take advantage of the shortage for our business, but we'll be ready in 2018, and we'll sell more trees then. I'm sure you will. Eric, good luck, and uh, all the best with this, okay?